Welcome back to another episode of Go to Go to where I try to become best as I can, Katahis to rank as I can. Um, day. Another ranked episode. I'll see you guys in a bit. I'm sweating so much. God damn. Oh yeah, by the way. I'm pretty sure when this episode uh, releases, the first episode of best team building series, however I want to call it, Subsea Dukes, okay, <laughs> interesting name, uh, has been released. What did you guys think of that video? I hope you guys enjoyed it a lot. Uh, I enjoyed making it and I'm gonna make more videos like that. For example, best team for, best team for offense, uh, best meta team, stuff like that, best tension building team, best uh, all around team, stuff like that I want to do. But uh, it takes a little bit of uh, preparation because I'm I'm go just doing my own fucking research. I'm just looking at every single player's passives and making a decision for myself because I want I want to make uh, really good teams that you guys can use for online that you actually have a chance of winning against other meta teams as well but i don't don't just want to god damn copy every single one of the videos everybody else makes so i really want to make my own really good teams that you guys can uh, choose to play as well right now i am i i have been playing but at the moment as well, I am playing the best team for defense. And I really fucking enjoy playing with this team. I've been playing with this team for a very long time now. Fuck. And to be honest, I don't really want to change it because I, I'm so used to it now. That I just don't want to change it, I guess. <laughs> Um, let's do a supernova. If you guys saw yesterday's episode, the 20 minute one. <laughs> I'm sorry for yapping, uh, but at the same time I really enjoyed talking uh, talking about uh, training because I've been doing it my whole life. If you would look at me, you wouldn't think I would have been training my whole life because I'm not necessarily big or anything. Uh... I, I, I sort of have like a Saitama body, I guess. You wouldn't really... A lean, a lean uh, body. Uh, because my goal isn't uh, to bodybuild, to get as big as possible. And my goal is just to get as strong as possible. And my own definition of strong, I guess. Because a lot of people's definition would be as... Because... The bigger you are, the stronger you are, right? So that doesn't make sense. But if you guys saw the last episode, you would know what I mean by becoming as strong as possible, I guess. Basically, uh, a recap. If you guys don't want to go back and see that one, I do recommend it. Um, it's... Nathan... Okay, nice. It's basically uh, getting as strong and good as possible in an all-around way. Like stamina, strength, explosive, uh, even bone strength, because that's good too, <laughs> you know. It's cool to have big muscles and strong muscles, but... If you bone break easily, that's not good either. <laughs> so, stuff like that. I haven't uh, trained my bones in a fucking long time. And if I uh, say train my bones, because it's probably <laughs> like, how the fuck do you train bones? It sounds weird. Uh, for example, I when I train my bones, I, mostly I train them my knuckles. For obvious reasons. Um, or I just punch... Uh, at the punching bag without any gloves because duh. <laughs> if you do that then <laughs> then your bones won't really uh, get stronger I get, it will but without it 
that's a lost stronger in my opinion, and it doesn't really hurt if you do it correctly. Uh, uh, and for example, or punching against the wall. I haven't do done punching against the wall in a long time because the walls in my house they have a certain paint layer that's that's just sticking into your fucking skin if you if you punch it. It's good, but at the same time it it hurts a lot because when you punch with a little bit of strength just a couple of times your hands are, are already fucking bleeding and that's not good you don't want to do that every single day so what i did for getting my knuckles stronger a lot of the times was shit. Uh, as well Okay, that's gonna be good. Let's do Flame Fortress right now, I'm spamming it at the moment. Okay, let's go. Um, I have so a medicine ball, I think you call it in English. Just a heavy weighted ball, you can do a lot of exercise with it. Uh, and it's pretty hard, but it's not like uh, metal hard, but hard enough. So I just punch that a lot of the times, and if you if you punch it hard enough, consistently enough, it won't really uh, damage it too much because you have to damage your bones to get it stronger. But at the same time, you don't want to damage them too much that you can't do it again. You know. So it's a little bit of a fidget thing around with that, with how much power you should use. Right here, okay. Um, let's do spares here, and let's move up. Okay. Uh, but when when I got in. Ooh, I don't know how I won that, but sure. When I did that consistently, when I'm doing that every single day, uh, I do notice <laughs> at certain point my flash around my knuckles, I guess. Uh, it sets up. It gets a little bit uh, bigger, like. But not bad. Just like, oh, I notice it, but it's not hurting, but you know. But there's always side effects. But I haven't trained bones in like, I don't know, a long time. Definitely longer than a year already. Uh, that's not good. Goddamn, no! That nice. So sad. Yeah, that's not a good thing to do. Forgot that you go quicker here. Okay. Sake. Let's do some shit, bitch. Okay. Death zone. Nathan is definitely going to be on time. In, unless he's going to move backwards here. By the way, uh, if you guys uh, train as well, it doesn't matter what you train or what your goals are. Comment down below. Because I would love to know what kind of uh, trainings you guys do. Or what your goals are. So, for example, calisthenics, learning uh, how to control your body more, or just with weights, bodybuilding, or running, stamina, stamina, I mean, or getting as fast as possible. 
there's all kinds of ways of getting stronger and that's what I love about it it's a uh, it's really nice because if you're for me at least if I'm tired of something because I've been doing it for so long I can just do anything else because there are so many possibilities so many things to become stronger now. For example, uh, I've been, as you guys know, I've been training jumping and getting higher and higher jumps and stuff like that. I've not, before I started training that again, I, I haven't trained that in so fucking long. But it's a great way of making your legs stronger as well. I don't know if Aether is going to be on time here. To be honest. Okay. Jack, what the fuck are you doing, fam? I guess just a catch. How long until the end of the match, actually? Oh, not that long. Hmm. Okay. Oh, easy peasy. Lemon squeezy, bro. Wide open. Ooh, the backflip as well. Nice. Nicely done. Oh. I thought for a second he got the. Uh, he passed it to me. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. And I don't have any tension to. I do have Super Bear here still though, for a little bit of time. A little bit of time, I have... Jack, you better be on time, you motherfucker! Okay. See, I am not going to... <laughs> ...to fucking waste time, like a lot of other people do. Oh, I'm... E I have more goals than you, but the time was just almost done, so I'm just going to keep the ball in my hands. Because I'm a fucking coward. A coward, bro, I tell you. Whoa, pff, damn, teleportation, bro, craziness. Jack with Ultra Instinct again. Back at it again, with Ultra Instinct. Ooh. Sadly enough, it's not going to be a goal. Got MV. Unless, breach. Nope. Certainly not. Match ended. Not a window. Let's go. Easy monies. Victory. I'm not going to keep con uh, continue talking again. Since la uh, same as last episode. Ooh, everybody's getting higher level. Nice. But I do hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. And if you did, consider subscribing. I will see you guys again tomorrow. Bye doobie doobie. Bye doobie doobie.